Oh god. I think I broke my hand. That's not how a hand's supposed to move. Ow! Why would you throw the bag to the guy with the broken hand? We'll catch it with the other hand. Hey, by the way, Reggie, have you been working out? Your shadow looks really buff. Not my shadow. Whoa! Is that the bat? That is a crocodile. And you are an idiot. Evening, boys. I'm new in town and I'm looking for some hired help. Interesting? Yeah, no thanks. Okay, boys. Go fight that giant crocodile monster. Uh, no? What? Why not? Take all the words you just used to describe that thing and say them again in your mind, because that is why not. Okay, I see your point. We will take you up on your offer of employment, Mr. Giant Crocodile Monster. Sir. Pleasure doing business with you. What did that do? Hmm? The button you just pressed. What did it do? Oh, it activated a new machine I invented uh, to automatically make your shrimp puffs, sir. Uh... Really? No. Oh. Well, what did it actually do? Can't recall, sir. Uh, probably something exciting. Uh, I hope that joke was worth a week's salary. No, but what the button actually did was... Mm. Oh, great. An alert. <laughs> The button did nothing. You know it did nothing, Alfred's just messing with you, so why are you worrying so much about it? I guess he was messing around with a lot of wiring, but no, no he wasn't, it's fine. You do realize I can hear you on the comm, sir? Yes, no, shut up. Just so we're all clear, that is the bat. Okay guys, I'm just gonna level with you here. I think we all know how this fight ends. So, I am giving you a one time only chance to escape this encounter with all of your bones intact. Just lower your weapons and step off the bo- Oh. Oh, you're you're going with the knives. No, no. Okay. All right. All right, Jab. Let's let's go. Oh, my other hand. Oh well. Would you look at that? A completely unexpected conclusion to that encounter. Screw you. Hey, maybe you should carry a third knife on you. Then I might not, you know, break both your hands. Oh, hand was already broken. Huh? Oh, wow. You know, I've never been attacked by walking luggage before. You know, crocodiles survived the extinction of the dinosaurs. Wait, you mean the Ice Age? What? You mean the media? The me- see, that's what I said. Point is, I ain't gonna be taken down by no bat! Ha! <laughs> that's a double negative. Shows what luggage knows about the English language- <laughs> Oh! No. Such a dick. I'm still awesome underwater. <coughs> Huge note to self. Bats hate water. <sighs> oh, what a surprise. The crocodile-themed villain has his hideout in a sewer. You know, I'm starting to think I'm just wasting money putting these trackers on villains. Oh boy, 
why didn't your mama ever teach you about uninvited guests? Nah, she was too busy being, you know, not alive. I suppose you're wondering what I'm doing down here with all these here maps of Gotham's... Of Gotham's canals. Yeah, you're gonna open up the dams and flood the city, right? Yeah, and I'll be able to take all the cash I want. So you're gonna sink Gotham to steal money? Yes. As in bills? Yep. Made of... paper. That's right! What's so hard to... Oh. Uh-huh. That is so embarrassing for you. A little bit, yeah. Well, I'll be seeing you. Oh, no, you don't. not be able to breathe underwater, but neither can crocodiles. <laughs> and once again, I'm left talking to myself. Still here, on the comm, sir. God, why do I not learn? Okay, Alfred, I give up. What did the button do? Close the garage door, sir. Oh. So this whole time you've been messing with me? Yes, sir. I see. Well, I guess you always did know how to push my buttons. <laughs> no, but seriously though, I am docking your pay.